Howdy y'all, it's Russell back with Gwinnett Lines in beautiful Atlanta, Georgia. Notice something? That's right, it's not raining. Today is March the 5th, 2019, and on today's video, I'm gonna do a real quick project for you. There are times when I don't wanna carry the trailer. I've got a little yard, posted stamp yard tomorrow. I'm just gonna take my Honda push mower and my weed eater and stuff that I need to just do that one property. And the problem is, let me show you what the problem is. Okay, so the problem is, I don't wanna to have to lift the mower in and out of the truck. This is a four wheel drive truck, so it's up a little higher than a two wheel drive. And yes, I can pick the mower up, but why? Why would I want to do that? Work smarter, not harder. So what I'm going to do is I don't have, I don't have any ramps. Ramps are expensive if you price the nice aluminum ramps that you can get. Those can run upwards of $110, $115. So we're going to make our own ramps. Very easy. I'm going to show you how. Anybody can do this. Bar your neighbor's drill and follow along as I show you how to do this. Directions. Who needs these? There are four carriage bolts and four nuts. Your drill. Gonna get a drill bit? I'll be right back. Next, this is very easy. Take the bracket, flip it over. Go steal your wife's pen Mark two holes. Just like that. Take a drill with a 5 16 inch. That's what I meant to say. And drill a hole. And the other side. Okay. Next. Make sure your bracket lined up. Mine's off because I can't drill a straight hole. That's all right. Hmm. Okay. Now, take your bolts. Open them up. Now these bolts carriage part or the uh, the nut is going to be on this side here it's still not lined up all right next take the nut Thread it on. And we're gonna get a socket and tighten it up. We've got a half inch socket. And you know this kit is made in America because it's half inch. I really don't know where it's made. Probably China. The, uh, the bolt is a little tight. I need more room, so I'm going to flip this over. Push that through a little bit. There we go. Just like Colonel Sanders would have done it. Strong. All right. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. No problem. And it, it even holds my weight. Now, uh, I wouldn't put anything heavier than something like I've got here. It's because it's not designed for a lot of weight. Let me get this space further apart. Okay. So that's how it is. I want you guys to get a good shot of it. Let me get a 
different angle here. All right. You get up to the customer. Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Very nice. Now when these are uh, done. The tailgate up. I can fit the mower that way and I can put the ramps just like that. Take my bungee cord. And there we go. Now, what did I accomplish? I accomplished not having a jacked up back from lifting this in and out. Plenty of room, no problem very pleased hey look anybody can do this all right guys so i hope i hope this little tidbit was helpful for you uh for you guys that are just starting out if you don't have a trailer i just showed you you don't need a trailer that wood at home depot cost me 550 a board so that's 11 dollars. and that bracket that adjustable bracket i think was 20 bucks at tractor supply that's about what they go for most of them aren't adjustable like that so yeah but it's easy no excuse no reason to jack your back up and put yourself out of commission for the season so thank you very much for watching if you guys found this helpful whatsoever or if you thought this was the most incredibly stupid thing you've ever seen please do leave a comment anyway I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. It's freezing. Thank you. If you haven't subscribed, on the right side of your screen, there's a little button that says subscribe. Click that. Then click the little bell icon next to it. You'll be notified as soon as I put up content, which I promise I will do a lot of mowing content. Um, leave me a comment, an encouragement, whatever you want to do. This is Russell, and I will see you guys on the next video. Does that sound nice? Nothing like a bunch of echoes idling. Let me show you guys one thing. One thing I did I had an old handle or two handles that I had on my old car ramps. So now, very, very easy. One hand transport, in fact, you can get both of them with one hand.